Okay, so I've been thinking about this for literally two weeks, and I just started and stopped and started and stopped and started and stopped, and it drove me crazy. Like, I knew that I had to do this or wanted to do this video about this content that I'm going to share with you, but I don't know why. I just, I would start it, literally, I started, I had got like six or seven starts of this video in horizontal format and vertical format, everything. And then I was just like, I walked out of my house and I started filming and I was like, I stopped. And then I just started walking. And that procrastination of not completing what, I had set out to do or that I wanted to do was driving me bonkers. And I thought, what is the, what is the benefit of not doing it? I wrote one time, you know, it's like, I think, I can't remember who said it, but it was like when the, and I've said it in videos, when, when the, the pain of something overweighs the pleasure of something, that's when you'll change, right? So I was sitting there going, why, why am I still, why am I not recording this video? And so I was writing an email that was going to go out. You're probably maybe watching this video because the email that's going out. And I was like, shit, I got it. I'm going to do the video. Like, just do the freaking video. So I'm doing the video and I, I'm, getting, I'm getting it done. And all right, so here's, the, here's what I was thinking about. You know, I wrote this book during COVID uh, called The Artist Survival Guide. And uh, went to number one on Amazon. That's not why I'm doing this. You can grab the book for free. You know, don't go to Amazon. Don't even have to pay for it. You can get it for free. Just go to yourstarpower.com slash ASG. You can get it for free. That's not why I'm doing this video. To tell you to get the book. Uh, I'm doing the video because when I was writing it, I, like, I'm not a salesperson. I'm not a sales guy. I'm, you know, I've done that. Like, I, I've, I'm a performer. I'm an artist. I'm a creator. Let's put it that way. I think I'm a performer. I'm a creator. I like to create stuff. Um, and I was writing this book to help other creators, other artists. And I realized that, you know, I'm not a salesperson. I've been around salespeople all the time. You know, I've never learned how to handle objections. I've heard about it. You know, I've been around people and I've heard people talk about it. What's the right jargon to close people? What's the right terminology? How do you do blah, and blah, blah? But I've never actually studied sales. It's not my thing. But as I was writing the book, I was like, wait a minute. I am completely wrong. Artists are salesmen. Creative people are salesmen. Because what am I selling? I'm selling what I do. I'm not selling like a pen or a product, a phone or insurance or whatever. I'm selling something that I create innately. Just like a writer would sell a screenplay or a painter would sell a painting. Um, and the way I do that is I go into a room as an audition when I was doing that all the time and I would put my product out and then I would get in front of an audience and put my product out in front of an audience when I was doing a show or doing a concert when I still do concerts. So I'm a salesperson. I am selling what I have and that equates to business. Because business people are selling what they have. And, and I have been in situations where there have been negotiations of like, well, you know, we, we want to go this way with somebody. We want to go that way with somebody. You know, we like your script. We, and, and you're negotiating on what happens. You're also negotiating on contracts. You know, how do you negotiate? Agents and managers. But I'm very involved. I was very involved in all of my contract negotiations. Um, so are salespeople. So how does that equate to business? I realize this. If I don't have an audience, I'm singing in a vacuum. I'm singing to an empty space. Certainly not making any money. I mean, just cut cut to the chase, right? Artists, we do it because we love it, but we have to we have to make a living. And if you have an empty theater, you ain't making any money. If no one's buying your art, no one shows up to the gallery, you're not making any money. If you don't have anybody in your pipeline, you don't have any clients waiting, then you have nobody to sell your your product too. It doesn't matter if you know how to close people, if you doesn't matter how to handle objections, doesn't matter any of that shit. You can you can be the best order, best communicator in the world. You can have the greatest story, which I teach as well. But if you're on a stage and there's nobody there, 
no one's going to buy your product. You're in a dry desert. It's, it's, it's a dry oasis. There's no water. It's not even an oasis. It's a tree with some sand. You know, maybe you get some shade. So, but you're there by yourself. But I realized this and I was like, well, I figured something out a little while ago. And I figured out how to get a lot of people to my concerts. And I started working on something and I have been able to generate in one particular business that I have with my wife, incredible targeted leads. Literally, people just coming. The stats, I have the stats, and I'll show them to you at some point, maybe do a webinar or something on this. Um, actually, we'll be doing a webinar on it. This is the whole point of this video. We had, I think it was in three weeks, 325 people give us their email addresses and their names. Just here, I want what you've got. We had a 19,000% increase. It's over 19,000 actually. In the people that opted in to what we were doing. 19,000%. It's crazy. And here's the thing. It didn't cost a dime. It was totally free. Absolutely free. Targeted. Wanting the product that we were offering wanting the thing and asking to be a part of it. In fact, we're turning away. I'm going to speculate on this because I'm, I'm roughing it. Out of one of, uh, out of every person we accept into this thing we're doing, we're turning 30 away. So we could potentially have that many more, but I want the audience to be targeted, specific, totally free. I mean, what would it be worth you to have a pipeline full of people who want what you're talking about, who want your product, and it doesn't cost you a dime? I don't know. I do. It's been pretty cool for us. Um, and it's pretty easy to do once you learn how to do it. It's just the learning how to do it that people aren't doing. So I want to share that because it's pretty cool. It's going to help a lot of people. That's really what it is. It's about helping a lot of people. Can you make money from it? Yeah, sure. You know, sell your products. But I like to help a lot of people because that's the number one pain point. Remember, guys, it doesn't matter if you're the best speaker, if you learn how to close, if you know the jargon, if you're up on stages, if there's nobody there, you got no sales. You got nobody to sell to. You got nobody to sing to. It's an empty theater. So that's this video. And that's what I was procrastinating about. Because I was trying to figure out how to close it. Like, how do I end the video? Do I go, call to action? Come join me. Well, not yet. I don't know. That's, that's really why I was procrastinating. So this thing is real. The thing that I, I'm doing is, is pretty real. We're seeing actual results. It's pretty simple. Anybody can do it. It's pretty cool. It's a lot of fun. Uh, and honestly, it doesn't take a lot of time. You can do it right from your phone. Where we are. Honestly. It doesn't take a lot of time at all. Um... It's just engagement. So if you're interested in that, let me know. Put something down in the comments or whatever. Reach out to me on my social media pages and uh, and let me know and I'll get you the info. And hey, you know, I got this group called Star Power. Um, it's a Facebook group. So you can go to, uh, you can go into Facebook and look for uh, Star Power. I think it's uh, Star Power Now. I think it's the name of the group. Anyway, if you want to join us over there, come on in. That's free too. Come on in. It's all free. And hey, here's the thing too, is don't procrastinate. Don't do what I did. Because I feel great now that I've shot this video. Like, it's done. I am finished the video. It didn't take that long. I'm talking to you. And it's a completed cycle of action that was sitting there open and driving me bonkers. Now I've done it. And all I had to do was sit at my desk, put my phone on a little tripod... Put the light on. You can see the ring light over there flashing against my, my poster. And um, I'm done. That's it. So don't procrastinate. Whatever you do, don't procrastinate. Go and finish what you're doing. Even if it's something small, just go finish it. All right? Have a good one. And uh, your destiny's waiting. It's about you going out and grabbing it. See you later.